Let's now talk about variable value and score. These are integral part of your statistical understanding. Variable is anything that varies. So let's take an example of a city. You have numerous buildings that are there. Now these buildings, when I take them or understand them on the basis of height, I can say height is one of the variables that I can understand. What is the value? Value is the category of the score that's there. So height of the building could be let's say from one um, from let's say six feet to 60 feet tall and that's the range in that city. So that's my value six to 60 feet. And if I want to find out the height of an individual building that's out there, I can say the height of the building is let's say 32 feet and that is the score. So three things to note here, variable, value and score. Variable is a characteristic which tends to vary and can have many different values that could be assigned to that variable. So here the variable is height. You can have lot of values that could be assigned to it in this case from 6 to 60. Those 6 to 60 are the values and the height of an individual building that's there is the score. Another example we can take is let's say children with the stress level. So there are 10 children there each having a different stress level. So what becomes a variable here? Variable is the level of stress Values are, I can rate this uh, stress from 0 to 10. So my values would, would range from 0, which is no stress, to 10, which is maximum stress level. And then there is a child who is sitting there and I want to calculate the stress value for that child. That becomes my score because for that child, let's say the stress level is 8. So I can say it's towards the higher side and this is what is the score. So a score is a particular person's value that is there. Value is the range or the category we could say in which the variable varies and variable is any characteristic which can be assigned different value which has a capability to vary. So variables, values and scores are the basis on which we understand the concept of statistics further because this is the foundation stone where we could understand the various techniques to measure uh, when we talk about later on the frequency table the frequency polygon we understand how these variables values and scores would be placed because most of the students get confused in arranging these values and variables